Tylenol. Did your mom leave you? Did my mom leave me what? Tylenol? Because they can't give it to you. Why is it so bright? Then here on this puzzle piece are the questions that are going to go with, along with today's PowerPoint. So, okay. So you're seeing me? Okay. So 
let's look at the question for number one. The Convention of 1832 oh. was called to tell the Mexican government that they wanted Texas to be a separate Mexican state, to allow immigration from the U.S., and to be exempt from import taxes. So how many items was that that they were asking for? <laughs> to be a separate Mexican state, to allow immigration from the U.S., and to exempt, uh, to exempt from import taxes. So how many items were they requesting? Yes. Now if you go to slide 12, okay, Texas met to discuss, um, met to discuss the Mexican government. They wanted, what did they want? No, look at it. I, that, my instruction said 14. If you guys would have heard, instead of being so busy talking, you would have heard me say that it turns out it actually starts at slide 12. Yeah. And to go back to slide 12. Okay, so here it says why did the, the, um, the Texans meet? Because they wanted a separate Mexican state, U.S. immigration permitted again an exemption of import taxes. Now look back at your question. Do the items here match the items on the PowerPoint? They match. It's true. If it doesn't match, it's false. Okay. For those of you that are doing it on paper, you're going to write number one and then write down if it's true or if it's false. All you got to do is have to write the question right now. All you got to do is write it true or false. Two is asking the convention of 1833 kept the resolutions, that's what they were asking for, number one, from the convention of 1832 and added a constitution for the Mexican state of Texas. Remember, during the first conventions, they were not trying to break away from Mexico yet. They were still trying to work with the Mexican government to try to get some of their grievances resolved, their complaints. Okay? Um, 
It's okay. So added to a constitution for the Mexican state of Texas and was taken to Mexico City by Erasmo Seguin. So let's look at our PowerPoint. The Convention of Earth, Earth 1833 keeps the old resolutions, adds a constitution for the Mexican state of Texas. Okay. And San is uh, SFA is uh, Stephen F. Austin and Erasmo Seguin were chosen to take the resolution to Mexico, but Seguin didn't make it, so Austin went alone. So was the whole statement for number two true? If there's any part of it that didn't happen, then it's false. So compare that you're gonna have, you may have to flip back and forth See, uh, with mine, you can see how it takes off the corners. Well, I don't know if you can tell, but it's taking off like an inch on either side of my screen. Yeah. So it's cutting off the windows. Um, so when you have when you have split windows, you, you don't actually have more to see than I do. Uh -huh. Yeah, so I can see it. It doesn't do that. Isn't it smooth the margins here? Okay, are we ready for number three? Yeah. Okay. So this is going to take us to the next slide. So we started with 12, 13, this should be 14 now. Okay. So question number three, slide 14. Stephen F. Austin wrote letters to San Antonio encouraging Texans to form their own blank. Meanwhile, Santa Ana had agreed to all of the resolutions except. So let's look at the uh, at the slide and see what Santa Ana wrote. So I mean, not Santa Ana, um, Austin. Stephen F. Austin got resolutions to Mexico City, but there were problems. He wrote letters to San Antonio encouraging Texans to form their own what? Is that one of your answer choices? Okay. So what you're going to do is you're going to click on plank one, and then you're going to click on the word government. You guys are with me? Oh, you did that. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. We don't know. Yeah. 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 You ha you 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 you. Click on this first. You can't just click on this and then click there. Okay. But. Now let's look at the second part. Okay. Meanwhile, Santa Ana had agreed to all the resolutions except Santa Ana agreed to all the resolutions except what? Yeah. Stay 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 what? Okay. But or however, <laughs> however, he repealed the U.S. immigration law. Okay. So he said. So he took it to repeal repeal. He took away the law that was preventing people from emigrating from the U.S. over to Mexico. Okay? So, what did, um, if you go back to the question, um, meanwhile Santa Ana had agreed to all the resolutions except what? There we go. Easy A? I guess. Mm -hmm. I got a question. Well, I got to take the question. What the heck? You know how? Okay. Please. So what you need to do is on question number three, since it's not a true or false, you're going to have to put uh, number three, government, comma, and then what the second answer is. Okay. Yes. I get a question. I don't need it. But I don't need it. I just need it. You're right. I'm just going to go on ball. But you've got to go. You, it, it's still. No, it's not. You just, you just have to take it so the office has a copy. When do everything is funny to him. So what, what does that have to do with the social studies? <laughs> Don't touch that one, right? Oh, you're really close to there. 
Hey, don't talk about it. Don't. don't. Uh, Zechariah is cool. Forget it, not a hundred, I'm going to be mad. Question number four. Stephen F. Austin's letters to San Antonio were intercepted. That means you guys know what the interception is from football? I don't care. Okay. Because he told Texans to create their own government, Austin was, and there were three correct answers. So what happened to Austin because his letters were, were intercepted? He was out for two years. Okay, hold on. Um, that's all I know. Okay, so let's, so let's look at the slide together. Okay. Austin's letters were intercepted and was arrested for treason. He was put in solitary confinement without a trial. He was held for two years. He was finally allowed to turn, return to Texas in July of 1835. Damn. What? And while in prison, the conditions in Texas got worse, and many people got um, malaria and cholera. What's that? It's, I a, hate it's you. like a stomach disease. Uh huh. You've got it. It said how many answers were correct? She left her shoe here. What? What? That Say. doesn't sound like schoolwork. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Cohen is disgust. Cohen is disgust. He is dead with him. He's wanted. <coughs> Even though you know you had a fever. What? Okay. Meanwhile, <laughs> What? Me on yo 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 um, caused trouble between Mexican and, uh, Mexico and the Texas colonists. William B. Travis. It's not 100 now. I'm gonna hit myself. Decided to take action. And acting on central uh, on Santa Ana's orders, General Martin Cause. Yes. I think that's how you pronounce it. I arrested did. Travis. Right. Santa Ana. Remember, he had become the president. Okay. He was no longer a federalist, but a centralist. So he didn't think that the, the power should be spread between the, 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 the central government, the federal government, and the state governments. He felt that the, that the state, the, not the state government, the central government um, should have all the power, and the state should have nothing. They should just follow whatever the, the government tells them to do. Okay? So looking at this slide, let's look at our next question. Okay, our number five. William B. Travis took action in response to custom duties that were implemented and as a result was arrested by Santa Ana. Okay, now look at this very, very closely. If all of it is correct, then it's true. If there's even one teeny little part of it that's wrong, then the whole thing is false. Yes. So look at it. It said, uh, William B. Travis took actions in response to custom duties that were implemented as a result 
was arrested, arrested by Santa Ana. Okay. So William B. Travis took action in acting on Santa Ana's orders. It's General See, Jackie. I can't even stop to write a list of who wants to go to the restroom. Jackie, we go play. Because you guys start talking. Is that ridiculous? Don't forget to leave your phone. What? What if you don't have any phone? Uh, <laughs> I'm stuck in California. Yes, we should try. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Now we're ready for number six, right? Yes. I guess. Now we're looking at the consultation of October 15, 1835. Okay. We also called it the convention of 1835. Okay. Look at the consultation of 1835. We've got four items, we've got a natchum. The items that we're looking at are colonists met at Washington on the Brazos too. The peace party was about what? The war party was about what? And Stephen F. Austin was convinced Santa Anna was a dictator. Okay? Remember, we had talked about it yesterday. We said Aunt Santa Anna had torn up the Constitution and said he was president for life. So, okay. So think of it. Think of this uh, as the column B is completing the sentences. So when you put the two parts together, they should make sense. Okay. Let's look at our next one. Okay. Consultation, October fifteenth, eighteen thirty-five. Remember, if I see you eating the ice, it goes in the trash. Colonists met at Washington on the Brazos to discuss general cause wanting to arrest colonists. Is that one of your answer choices? Okay, so what matches it? So what you're going to do is you're going to click on one. See how it, see how it's highlighted up here? And then click on the one. They want to do what? Right. Result, 
There's a timeline. 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 There's a Okay. Oh, so let's go through this, this timeline. Oh, oh, you're not coming back? Oh, oh, okay. I thought you were saying that she was bringing in this mess. Okay. okay. Well, so don't take the office pass, but take your stuff. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay, so what, what, are you, what are you asking? I didn't catch what you're asking. Um, on the big question. Um, the, it says a big question on the slide. Just scroll right down. Oh, this one? Yes. Why do the lights keep flashing? Oh, okay. This is just something to discuss. We can discuss that after we're done putting the, putting the timeline. Oh, I gotta put my laptop. Thank you, Israel, for building in the cheat for us. Thank you, Israel. Thank you, question mark. Thank you. Thank you. Are you watching the ball game? What the hell? I think someone else is watching ball game dolls. Yes, if you want to get, guys, if you don't like the grades, you got to have it set for free and hands. I got a honey. I got a honey. I got a hundred. I got a hundred. Third attempt. Oh, God. Oh my god, he's shredding the fuck. Zach, look at Bambi. You got the old yeah. He's shredding the shit.
Okay, when you're done, did everybody find the cheat? Yes. Okay, if you were handwriting it, you just need to write the events in order. Yes, please. What is an exit ticket? You should come here every day because this is the best in classes active the entire school. Yeah, I this is the, if I needed to, I would. This is, this, is, this, is, this is the most work I've ever got. We actually have time to spare. I'm like, woo! Mm -hmm. okay. See, you guys know how to act. You just choose not to. Because my friend is here. Okay, so which one do I do? Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, oh. Okay. So guys, we finished here the growing tensions in Colonial Texas. Oh, I do that exit okay. ticket. The exit ticket is here. Oh. What I'm trying to do this week, I'm doing them as exit tickets. Next week, I'm doing them as uh, warm-ups. They're put their practice questions off the test. Okay. So you really, really, really want to do this. Um, Wait. So, what was the main purpose of the law of April 6th? Fill in the, the fill-in-the-blank drop-down. So, let's go, let me do grading, preview, set up, questions. Okay, here we go. The main purpose of the law of April 6th, 1830 was to block Mexicans from settling in Texas, to prevent Texas from declaring independence, to end the trade between te look, Texas and Mexico, or to stop immigration from the United States. Remember we talked about it, it kept coming up all of last week because that was part of the chain of events. Oh yeah, that I, I knew that. And there are, I believe, three correct answers. Wait, what? Yes. So then if I get this wrong, I'm stupid. Wait, I got it wrong because it said to encourage. So then I got it. So then I... Do what I did! Shh. 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 Oh my god, I'm at like 20 frames. I missed it. How you get zero? That's it. But how's it? The puzzle? Yeah, do the puzzle piece. Don't do the discussion. We do polygon. Oh, yeah. What are you doing? What? What is zero? <laughs> How'd you get zero? <laughs> I don't have a space ball, so this is gonna be kind of weird. Does We're both have the <laughs> I don't have any money. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Look at the dancing.
Look at me. Look at me. What? No. Whose phone do I have? Sebastian. Marcos, do you have 50 I'm done with this. Hello? Hi. Hi. <laughs> Are you <rude? laughs> Did you record the whole thing? Did you record the whole thing? Go, go, You need to wait. You need to wait. Go, go, I want to keep my knee I just play. I just deal with my life. Michael, why am I Wait. Wait.